DraftSite 2018 adds many new features to enhance usability and productivity. Let's first look at some of the usability improvements designed to make common design tasks simpler and more efficient. DraftSite 2018 now supports arrow key movement, making the process of moving entities simpler and more accurate than using the traditional move command. To do so, simply select the entities to be moved, hold down the shift key, and press the arrow keys to move all selected annotations and geometry. When happy with the position, click Escape to quit the command. You can change the default increment settings under Options to suit your needs. Redefine Block Base Point is another usability improvement that allows you to quickly and easily redefine the base point of a block. Now you can simply select the block, right-click on it, and you'll get the option to redefine the base point. Just select the Redefine Block Base Point tool and then choose the new location for the base point. It really is that quick and easy. Another new usability feature in the right-click dialog is the Paste to Active Layer tool. This allows you to copy, then, as the name suggests, paste entities on the currently active layer regardless of the original source layer. As you can see, the pasted entities are now on the active layer. DraftSite 2018 has also enhanced the visualization color options when highlighting and selecting entities. In addition to the previous dashed line type display, now hovering over objects will change their color to orange. And once selected, these objects will change to the color blue. This allows you to see which entities are selected quickly and precisely whether you have zoomed out on a large model or your drawing contains many objects. In addition to usability improvements, DraftSite 2018 provides several new powerful and time-saving productivity tools. Dedicated for professional and enterprise users, these tools increase speed and efficiency when designing or documenting projects. Previously in DraftSite, all commands and numeric data were entered at the command window. Using the new quick input methods of DraftSite 2018, you can now enter distance and angle directly in the drawing area. This provides a more efficient and easier method of inputting data and drawing in DraftSight. Another time-saving feature in DraftSight 2018 is the Curved Text tool. This automatically places text along a selected arc with your desired justification, height, and offset. Now placing text along an arc will no longer be a difficult or tedious task. DraftSite 2018 has implemented a very important and powerful foundation component for dimensions called the Bounding Box. This allows you to manage dimensions smarter and easier. After creating the Bounding Box, you can insert a smart dimension with a new widget icon. If clicking on the yellow half, the dimension moves to the top of the Bounding Box. If selecting the blue half, it goes to the bottom. When inserting another dimension, the previous dimensions automatically and smartly adjust their position to allow for the new dimension. If selecting an arc or circle, you get a widget icon with four different quadrants. The location of the dimension depends on which quadrant you select. As you can see, the new dimension bounding box makes the placement of dimensions in DraftSite a simple, pain-free task. Another nice improvement in DraftSite 2018 is the ability to quickly move any dimension by simply clicking on it and dragging it to the desired location. This applies to all dimension types. As demonstrated, DraftSite 2018 provides significant functionality and value, especially to users of the professional and enterprise versions. These are just eight of the great features added to this release that improve usability and productivity when designing, drafting, or detailing your projects. To learn more about DraftSight and how to get a free 30-day trial of DraftSight Professional, visit DraftSight.com professional.